Hello, my friends, and welcome to Master Coding channel. And we will continue with the Automata exercises inside the Automata playlist and the coding theory. And this exercise number six is telling us to construct using Gluskov an Automat accepting this language. So what is the first language we need uh, in this exercise to construct? It is a it's part a and next videos we will continue with part a and b and c so first of all part a is telling us to construct l equal to a a b star a b we need to draw the an an automat that accepts this uh this language so First, using Gluskov. Gluskov is telling us that the first step here, first step is making, and let me change the color in order to differentiate the steps from the questions. Okay. This is good. I will remove this and I will call first step. Gluskov telling us to start by giving an index for every item. So what this means, so L equal, this is the index number one, index number two, three, four, and five. How to translate them? We are going to number them. So A1, A2, B3, star, a4 star uh, a4 and b5 this is the first step okay just numbering and indexing them so the first step here index indexing the second step second step is making and, and giving which is the premiere and the, and the first and the last items the first item here the premiere or the first first item is equal to a1 it's very simple and the last item is b5 see guys this is the first item and this is the last item okay the third step let me change here the third step is putting them inside a table so the table here I will make a, a, a I will construct a table here. Or we can let me okay, I will create it like this. And here we put the letter the letter and here we put the following we start which is the first what is the first uh, letter it is obviously let me change this it is obviously is a one so i put a one here and what is the following uh name uh, what is the following uh item it is a two so i put a two change it to a two okay so a one is followed by a two okay this is the 
the function of the state again a2 we have finished a1 we are going to a2 what is the following uh, number uh, the following letter uh, after a2 it is b3 so i go and put here b3 remember guys it's you need to pay attention here it's very important thing b3 or b star the star here as you know it is composed of e first time is sigma and the second st state it is b3 okay you need to uh, to pay attention for this notice so if we look here there is a star b3 one time would be an epsilon and one time would be a b3 so we put this this options into our table first time it is epsilon and for a second time is b3 so b3 is here we have put it and we will continue with a2 so a2 here would be uh, the next step it would be the epsilon so epsilon does not we cannot put epsilon here we need to remove it and put the letter next to b3 which is a4 so guys it may be a little confusing i will lecture it so uh, the first time a1 a2 b3 a4 and uh, a5 or b5 the first time it is presented as b and the second time a1 a2 it's presented as epsilon so a4 and b5 so the first the first time we put it as b3 and the second time we put it as a4 because we neglect the presence of uh, epsilon and we put the next uh, the letter next to a2 which is a so this is the case it's very simple guys we will continue okay and here we have now b3 what is the next of b3 it is also b3 as I told you, the next of B3, it is first time it is Epsilon and the second time is B3. So the first time is B3, sorry, B3, and the second time B3 is adjacent to A4. So the first time we put, we, uh, put B3, and the second time we neglect the presence of b3 because it is an epsilon and the last thing is a4 the next of a4 is b5 so remember guys this question is uh, very tricky because we have b and the star the first time we take it as uh, epsilon and the second time we put it as presented b so b star epsilon and the second time would be b this is the table of gluskov now uh, just for remembering you that b star is equal to epsilon plus b1 plus b2 plus b3 and etc okay it's very simple guys we took we took now the this table and try to draw the uh, automat i will draw the automat here using the color like like this okay 
or let me choose like this okay you see the table here in front of us the fir the fourth step is to draw first the fourth step is draw we start the initial state here would be i and going to a1 so the the automat will start with a1 so this is a1 so if i want to go to start with automat i should press a and the automat will go and to a1 and then to the later states and if i want to continue a1 you remember guys the the automat it is a1 a2 b3 a4 and b5 so i need now to go to if i press a this is a we have finished the second a2 i need to press a to go to state a2 you see guys this is a2 and from a2 according to the table we have two states so if i press a i would get a go to a4 and if i press b i would go to b3 so I will put here B3 and I will put here A4. If I press A2 if, or if I am presented at A2 and I press A, according to the table, it will give me an A4. So A2, it will give me a and a2 would give me b3 if i press b okay now from b3 if we see guys b3 it would give me b3 if i press b so this is b and if i press from b3 a it would give me to a directed me to a4 so this is a and again in the last step here we have we have a4 we have a4 here so i need if i press a4 a, if i press a it will give me to b5 so it's very simple guys it's the final step here it's called b5 okay this is the automat that we have uh, made okay uh, the fifth step and the last step is converting this uh, a and uh, one b2 b3 automat to the correct and the initial one which is uh, one, two, three, or four. We can you can make it and you can keep uh, like this, but I prefer making this step for making uh, for uh, for not to get any mistake. Fifth three draw. The fifth step is making the correct automat. you can you can skip this uh, uh, step but i'm making it for for demonstration so a it will give me to the first it will take me to the first uh, state so this is the first step the state it going to two by pressing a i will make it here too and from 2 I will go to 
four and I will go here to three B and pressing A and from here we go to press an A and here B and the final step here is the five the fifth step so this is our automat okay so this is the question is telling us to draw the automat for this l equal to a a b star a b and we have the first step indexing the second step is taking the first and the last item in order to determine the initial and the final step this is the initial and this is the final step and the third step is making a table that tells us what are the possibilities of uh, the the conversion and, and the transmission of these uh, transmission of these uh, states so a1 takes me to a2 if i press a a2 if i press b it will give me give me b3 if i press a it will give me a4 if i press with a b3 b it will give me uh, b3 and b3 if i press a it would give me an a and the last step a4 give me the next step which is the b5 and we draw the we start drawing like this and the final step is making the draw correctly like this translating this table this table into this automat okay so this is the our automat and this is our example about Gulskov. see you next example don't miss to like and subscribe if you if you like these videos and if you will if you like our uh, way of uh, lecturing i hope you subscribe and like to push us making new tutorials thank you guys